What is happening guys? Jonathan here aka Crazy Shadow 303 here with another match vlog on Crazy Shadow Talks Football and it is a massive massive game tonight. It's a local derby, the first of a local derby double header. We have Birmingham next week um, at St Andrews but tonight we are heading to the Hawthorns again for the first time in about a month. Um, first league game since 2nd of January, so literally a month since our last league home game. And uh, yeah, we're against Coventry. So looking forward to the trip from the Sky Blues. Um, they have been okay, they're mid-table, but they did beat us 1-0 uh, in the reverse fixture at the Coventry Building Society Arena. Uh, it was a penalty, obviously. Um, you know, they beat us 1-0. Corbrand's first league defeat in charge of the Albion. So, yeah, I mean, we have had a bit of a mixed bag in January, to be honest. Uh, since our last league home game, we, uh, we've played three FA Cup games. Won one, drawn one, and lost the other. So we're now out the FA Cup. Uh, thanks to Bristol City, um, we couldn't do what we did against them in the league and uh, beat them 3-0. In fact, it was a little bit of revenge for Bristol City, 3-0 uh, to them at Ashton Gate uh, last weekend. And yeah, so now we're out the cup. That's kind of a bittersweet, uh, bittersweet situation uh, for the Albion because now we can concentrate on trying to finish in playoffs instead of having the FA Cup as a distraction. Um, and... Uh, yeah, Bristol City have got Manchester City in the next round. So, uh, <laughs> so yeah, I think we may have dodged a bullet there um, in the next round against Man City. But, yeah, I mean, on to tonight. Coventry, as I said, you know, their main man, uh, I can't pronounce his name for the life of me, uh, Gilchrist or something like that. Um, still can't pronounce his name properly, but, yeah. Uh, look out for him tonight uh, if he's playing for the Sky Blues. Obviously, we had a couple of deadline day signings, which, you know, considering the circumstances financially, I'm not too, um, I'm not too uh, miffed about, to be honest. I'm pleased that we've actually got some signings. Uh, Nathaniel Chalaber from Fulham on an 18-month deal. So, yeah, not alone. Um for Nathaniel Chalaber. And we've got former Premier League champion with Leicester, uh, Mark Albrighton. And, you know, I actually do rate um, Albrighton. So let's hope they feature tonight, um, Chalaber and uh, Albrighton, because there's a wealth of experience there, especially with Mark Albrighton. As I said, 2016 Premier League champion with Leicester City. They're... Um, you know, their phenomenal season that they had winning the title and their 2021 FA Cup victory as well, which Mark Albrighton was a part of as well. But yeah, I mean, looking forward to tonight. As I said, it's the first of a double header of local derbies because we have Birmingham at St Andrews next weekend. And yeah, um, hope to see you. Uh, hope to see you at the Hawthorns, guys. See you in a bit. All right, guys, as we're approaching the Hawthorns now, a um, couple of shout outs for the vlog, uh, both requested by Connor from West Brom Fan TV. Uh, happy birthday to Amy Pincher, whose 21st was on the 8th of January, so quite a while back, um, but obviously, first league home game since her birthday, so happy birthday, Amy. And Courtney DeMarco, whose 23rd birthday is on the 8th of February I believe so yeah happy birthday to both Amy and Courtney and yeah hope the Albion pull off the victory for you uh, today and yeah happy birthday girls 
Boing, boing. Alright guys, prediction time. Just met up with Darren. Um, local derby at the Hawthorns tonight. Uh, first of a double header, Coventry here, then Birmingham at St Andrews next weekend. Uh, so what are your thoughts, Darren? Well, yeah, I know we're out of the FA Cup. Yeah, so we got full focus on the league now. Yeah, yeah. And to be honest, I know Button is in goal, but surely it's not going to be that bad. No, it, I mean... It, to be honest, he, he knows it's the league. Yeah, it, it's the so league now. Surely I think rumours circulating today that Alex Palmer I is injured. I think yeah, so. I think so. Because how else, how else would Corbyn choose Button? Yeah, so we've got a change this. between the sticks in uh, David Button instead of Alex Palmer. And, yeah, I mean, Mark Albrighton's starting as well, I've heard. Yeah. New signing on deadline day. Uh, yeah. Mark Albrighton from know, Leicester. I don't know if Nathaniel Chap. Chabala. Chab yeah. Yeah, Nathaniel Chabala. I can't be good pronounced. Yeah, he, he's, prob he's probably on the bench. He's probably on the bench. I but yeah, check. I mean, yeah, you check, mate. Uh, so, prediction. Well, ignore what I said earlier, because I felt negative <laughs> earlier. I'm going to go with a close. 2-1 win for the Albion. 2-1 win for the Albion. I'm actually going to go 3-1 Albion. Um, I'm thinking Albrighton to score a debut goal. And I'm thinking DK and Dean Garner. Um, I'm, so, I'm yeah. thinking Albrighton debut goal and DK. Yeah, I'm going to go with Albrighton debut goal. Yeah, I'm going to go with Albrighton debut goal. And DK twice. Yeah. Uh, DK once, yeah. yeah DK yeah, once. I only said two and, and again, I can't pronounce his name like I said in the intro. Gilcross? Gricos? Uh, for Coventry to yeah, score? Yeah. Uh, Victor Gil... Gil yeah, still can't pronounce it. <laughs> can just, yeah. Can I just say that, Casey Palmer? All right, Casey Palmer. It's easier. It's easier to pronounce. Uh, so, yeah. So, Darren's saying 2-1. I'm saying 3-1. Either way, we need to get back on winning ways and get back in the playoffs. Even if it's just temporary because everyone else played tomorrow and Monday. So, yeah, come yeah, on, Albion. Yeah, cause, boing, boing. Yeah, because we should have played tomorrow, but because of... Uh, yeah, Wolves. television. Television and Wolves playing tomorrow as well. Yeah. Come Villa. on, Albion. And Villa, yeah. Come on, Albion. Boing, boing. Right, guys, joined, as always, by Connor and Liam from West Brom Fan TV. I have done the uh, shout-outs that you requested, by the way. Oh, thank you. Uh, so, yeah, um, happy, happy birthday yeah, to Amy and Courtney. Um, what are your thoughts on today? It's the first... Double, it's the first of a double header of local derbies because next weekend we're at St Andrews down the road. Yeah, um, I think it'll be a tough game as always. You know they've got some good players, but that being said, I do think we'll win tonight. I think it'll be a two-one win. Bristol, I know it's the cup and it's nice to have a cup for them, but our main focus is to get, you know, go up via the playoffs because yeah, you know yeah. money's tight at the minute at the Hawthorns and yeah, absolutely. You know we need to win as many games as we can, get back into the swing of winning. Yeah. I'm going to go 2-1 Albion, I'm going to say. I'm not sure on goal scores, I can't remember what I said, and I don't want to contradict myself. No, of course. But I think Nob Perez will probably score for them. He's a, he's a great striker, but yeah. I'm excited for yeah. tonight. Awesome. Liam? I bet Cyril Regis as well. Um, oh, yeah, nice the tributes. Tributes, yeah. Yeah, yeah so yeah. Um, yeah, I'm going to go 3-1 to Albion tonight. Um, disappointed about Palmer. Very disappointed yeah. about him being injured. Not sure how long it's for. I've heard people say it's the rest of the season. Um, but I'm going to go 3-1 tonight. Um, I think my scorers were DK, um, Yukuslu and Wallace. So, yeah. um, for them, um, that bloke. That no Gilchrist, one can yeah, pronounce. That no one, only Connor can pronounce his name, yeah. Gilchrist. Um, so, yeah, guys, uh, Chalabar from Fulham and Mark Albrighton, who's a Premier League winner with Leicester, yeah. You know, so the experience is there. Yeah. What do you make of that? I would say it was a transfer window, but it was literally a day. transfer day. Yeah. So, so, first things first, one of the best bit, bit of businesses we did was got rid of Zahor. That guy yeah. was stealing a living at that club. He couldn't even make it into the under 23s. It was yeah. that bad. Waste of eight million. All Brighton. He's a, ma he's a winner, isn't he? He's, he's been Absolutely. at Leicester when they won the Premier League. And the FA Cup. Even if he's not great on the pitch, the experience he, has, he will have inside the dressing room will be key. Yeah, Chalibur's won promotions. So, you know, 
good signings. Yeah, in yeah, it's not many sign-ins, but it's decent signings, yeah, yeah. isn't it? I agree, yeah. yeah, thanks, guys. Nathaniel Chalaba on the bench as well. The other deadline day signing. Nathaniel Chalaba on the bench. Mark Albrighton starting. Alex Palmer is injured, so not featuring tonight. And David Button in goal. Come on, Albion. Bye bye. All right, game has started, guys. Albion kick off with Double DK. Come on, Albion. We need to win this, the first of a local derby double header. Coventry tonight. Birmingham at St Andrews next weekend. Come on, baggies. Boing, boing. Four minutes in, guys. Early chance for the Albion. Uh, DK just headed over from a Mark Albrighton cross, to be fair. He did well to keep the ball. Mark Albrighton stating intent right from the get-go. Um, decent cross. DK just headed over. Chance for the Albion. Chance for DK. Come on, Albrighton, as well. And uh, yeah, still no no guys. Come on, Baggies. Seven minutes in, guys. Second chance for the Albion. Uh, again, Mark Albrighton from the right-hand side. Uh, I think that's going to be the general theme of tonight with Mark Albrighton crossing in for the strikers. But this time it was Jed Wallace that fired just over. So, yeah, we're finding, we're finding some progress here with uh, Mark Albrighton down the right-hand side. So, decent signing on deadline day this week. Um, Premier League winner in 2016. FA Cup winner in 2021, both with Leicester City. And, yeah, looking really impressive so far in the first seven minutes of the game. Uh, creating two chances uh, for DK and Jed Wallace. But, yeah, we're on the attack again. Oh, we're on the attack. Go on! Oh, Dean Garner. Dean Garner skipping through bodies. Oh, Brighton again! Oh, keeper claims. Keeper claims. But Dean Garner skipping through bodies there. Come on, Baggies. Bye bye! Shine the light at point, my the towel come on long throw it's floated in floated in oh my god yes yes got out with the towel long throw it's in one now one now to the baggies yes come on who's got it they got it yes great day great day they got it how 
we are one! Coventry now! Come on! It was coming. Come on! Who are ya? Who are ya? Who are ya? Let's go! <laughs> 15 minutes play, guys. Donald Furlong with the towel. Long throw into the box caused all sorts of problems with Coventry. Come on, and Dayan Garner capitalises. What a goal! What a goal! 15 minutes play, guys. Albion won. Coventry nil. Come on! <laughs> Alright, 22 and a half minutes played guys. Old Brighton's done really well in the first 22 minutes for the number 22. Uh, his new squad number within the Albion. Um, yeah, I mean, he's been putting in a lot of early crosses. He loves an early cross. I wonder you know, if he's done that against for Leicester. Well, multiple times for Leicester. He must have done it. He loves an early cross. He's taken uh, the, the one and only corner that we've had. Um, here he comes again. Oh! Oh! Short. Oh, it's a corner. It's another corner. I'll give us that in. Yeah. <laughs> he, he put in the cross. Okay, he scuffed it a little bit. Still fell to Jed Wallace. Jed Wallace tried the shot, got blocked. And it's now another corner to the Albion. Lucas taking it again. Mark Albrighton with the corner again. Come on, man. Come on, Mark. He loves the early cross. He must have done this countless times for Leicester. You know, come on. Oh, low cross, outside the box, oh! It's a nice idea, nice idea. Not sure if that was Malumbi or Wallace, but Albrighton with the low cross to the edge of the box. And yeah, Malumbi or Wallace from outside, from outside the box puts it, puts it just over. That was a nice idea though. You know, all the creativity from Mark Albrighton there. To, uh, to spot the low cross. Uh, so yeah, 24 oh. minutes played, guys. Still, Albion 1, Coventry nil. 27 minutes played, guys. Another throw in oh, to yeah. the Albion and another instance of the towel from Darnell Furlong. It worked so well the last time. Come on. Can we make this 2-0 from the same type of goal? Come on. It's over, into the box. Oh! Uh, this time, Coventry do get ahead to it, but we try and cross it. It goes over everyone. Dean Garner's chasing, trying to shield the ball. Oh. We do well to keep it. We do do well to keep it. So we're trying to recycle now. Uh, I think it's gone back to Eric Peters. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Come on. Oh, nice. Yeah, Dar Rocher, nice feet there. Oh, which we are trying to get it through, but Coventry, Coventry trying to defend, but we're getting the ball back. We're not giving them time on the ball at all, which is good oh, for the scale, Albion. Scale, scale. Oh. oh, he's still keeping the ball. Oh. Eventually, no, we get it back. Oh. One, oh. oh, so close. Oh. oh, it was curling all the way, but not quite enough. Not quite oh. enough. How did that not go in? I 29 minutes. It, it yeah, it, it was curling, but it didn't curl enough to warrant a goal. It was just, you know, inches wide, inches wide. 29 minutes played, guys. Still somehow Albion won, Coventry nil. 31 minutes played, guys. Uh, bit of a worrying time here for the Albion. Uh, it looks like Yakuslu has pulled something. Um, he went straight down and the ref immediately stopped play. Immediately stopped play. Um, I f the physio came on. I think Yakuslu has pulled something. Uh, yeah. I'm scared now. Yeah, so uh, Coventry's getting some instructions now, basically their boss telling them to, in, for want of a better word, calm down. Because um, at the moment, we are not giving them any time on the ball whatsoever. We're not letting them play their game. Uh, just a little bit of a break in play here. 
hopefully Yakuslu's okay. He just went down a bit funny. Um, looked like he had pulled a hamstring. I hope that's not the case. But the physio came on to check uh, just to make sure. Uh, he seems okay. Seems okay. We're continuing. Uh, it was a drop ball which was given straight to the Albion. So yeah, 32 minutes play, guys. Hopefully Yakuslu is okay. Uh, Albion won, Coventry nil. 37 minutes play, guys. Uh, Coventry got an attacking free kick. Fortunately for us, it was well over the bar. Um, so yeah, Button's got the ball now. Plays it out. Uh, but yeah. Oh, that's a free kick. <laughs> That's a free kick to us, much to the annoyance of the Coventry fans in the Smevic end. Uh, but yeah, 38 minutes played, guys. Coventry had a free kick, tried something clever, but it went straight over. Fortunately for the Albion, uh, 39 minutes played, and it's still Albion 1, Coventry 0. Come on, baggies. Uh, 44 and a half minutes, guys. Oh, oh, oh nearly, but it trickled harmlessly to Coventry's keeper. We had a throw in. Uh, tried to do something about it but uh, couldn't quite make it went to their keeper uh, 15 seconds before we find out how much uh, injury time is at the end of the first half still 1-0 Albion uh, we've we've done pretty well this half to be honest we have done pretty well you know um, we haven't let Coventry play their game two minutes added on two minutes added on um, so yeah, we haven't let Coventry play their game. You know, we've kept the pressure on. Mark Albrighton has been phenomenal. Um, Grady Dean Garner took the goal well. Uh, Coventry cleared that, but only as far as uh, a blue and white shirt. Um, and yeah, that's a free kick to us. That's definitely a free kick to us. You know, last defender, last defender for the Albion and managed to get the ball away from the attacker and the attacker just pulled him down so definitely a free kick to the Albion there takes some pressure off uh, leading into half time two minutes added on we're in that now but yeah Albion have definitely been the stronger of the two sides in this half uh, this is looking like a half time score guys Albion 1 Coventry 0 come on baggies oh, DK did well to keep the ball almost 2-0 just before half time, guys. If this goes in. We get a corner, Mark Albrighton to take. Um, yeah, I mean, DK was on the floor, still managed to keep the ball away from two and Coventry it, players. And, it, oh my and nearly did a 1 2 with uh, it looked like Malumbi. And yeah, couldn't quite make it. It almost was an own goal from Coventry as well. You know, it could have easily yeah. been an own goal from Coventry. It's floated in by oh. Albrighton. Uh, didn't quite, uh, yeah. It's another corner. Connor Townsend with the header, but it deflected oh, off uh, Coventry head. Oh. And here comes Grady oh, Dean Garner to take the corner now. So it's another corner for the Albion. Come on, Grady, the goal scorer, the difference maker. Come on. Come on, if we can make it 2-0 right now before half time, that would be awesome. And Coventry would have a lot of work to do in the second half, come on. Dean Garner in, oh. only as far as uh, Coventry player, and that's it. Half time, guys. <laughs> Half time. So far, so good. Albion the better of the two teams in this derby. West Bromwich Albion won, Coventry City nil. You know, Grady Dean Garner took his goal well. Mark Albrighton been instrumental in this first half with his crosses, early crosses and corners as well. You know, Dalo DK has kept the pressure on, not given their keeper a moment's peace. You know, had to rush um, his distribution. Commentary players are clearly not happy, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, Albion are one 0 to the good. So far, so good. Stronger team in that half is was the Albion, and yeah. Oh my days, that was a good performance. We needed a performance like that in the first half after getting knocked out of the FA Cup. So, yeah, I mean, what a game. What a game so far. Dean Garner with the difference maker. Mark Albrighton, phenomenal so far. Great first 45 minutes in an Albion shirt for him. You know, as I said, former Premier League winner, former FA Cup winner with Leicester City. 
and now Albion have got him on loan for the rest of the season. Brilliant. Looking forward to seeing if Nathaniel Chalabar will get on in the second half. Let's see how he gets on. And yeah, you know, really good, really good half. As it is, so far so good. We're in the playoffs for now, like in the playoff places. So yeah, half time guys. West Bromwich Albion 1, Coventry City 0. Come on baggies, let's see this through. Boy, boy. All right, guys, Coventry have just kicked off the second half. Got to say, awesome tribute to the late, great Cyril Regis um, at halftime. You know, gospel choir, you know, interviews with his family. Um, and, yeah, awesome club legend. Didn't have the privilege to see him in action myself. I was way too young, but, yeah. Club legend to both West Brom and Coventry, I say. Yeah, he played for both clubs, Albion and Coventry. It's only fitting that both teams pay tribute to him. Both sets of fans pay tribute to the late, great Cyril Regis. Um, I remember in 2018 um, watching Albion against Coventry pre-season match, um, which I think we won 5-2 yes. to win the first ever Cyril Regis Shield. Um, and not so this, yeah, and not to this date was the only one. Yeah, we won the Civil Ridge Shield, uh, beating Coventry 5-2, um, and that was one of my most fondest memories of this fixture, Coventry at home. Um, so yeah, but that was recent. That was 2018, like literally the summer after his passing. So yeah, um, as always, rest in peace, Cyril. Both Albion fans and Coventry fans alike, love you, man. And yeah. But now, on to the second half. Uh, Albion 1, Coventry 0. Albion have got the ball now and we're working it well. Much to the uh, delight of the, uh, the Hawthorns crowd, as you could hear. Uh, a few rounds of applause there for the play. And yeah, Coventry keeper's got it now. So yeah, 46 minutes played, guys. Still, Albion 1, Coventry 0. Rest in peace, Cyril. Alright guys, 50 minutes played. Still 1-0 to the Albion. Coventry are getting back into the game a little bit. Had a few chances, uh, as well as uh, a corner, which fortunately for us came to nothing. We had a corner of our own just down the other end by the Brummie Road. Um, but, yeah. Come on, Button. There we go. To, to Dara, to Dara. Oh. Did well to keep it. Come on, just boot it. Button does well to boot it. That's Button does well to boot it. Almost went straight to DK. Uh, but yeah, I mean, we had a chance as well. Uh, but our corner again came to nothing. A few shouts of handball from the Coventry fans there for some reason. Uh, but yeah, oh. Coventry keeper gets it. Uh, so 52 minutes play, guys. Still, Albion 1, Coventry 0. Come on, Albion. Double DK is coming off. Brandon Thomas Asante comes on. 58 minutes play, guys. Brandon Thomas Asante is on just as the second Shine a Light protest happens at the Hawthorns. And you can hear. <laughs> you can hear the chant, guys, of O Thomas Asante. Uh, so, yeah. 58 minutes play, guys. First sub to the Albion. DK off, he's done well. Unfortunate not to get a goal today. Um, but yeah, DK off, Brandon Thomas Asante on. Still 1 0 to the baggies. Come on, Albion, boy boy. Throw in to the Albion, 58 minutes played. Darnell Furlong with the towel again. Third time this match, I think. Um, first one is where we scored the goal. Uh, sent it in again. Only goes as far as the commentary head. Uh, but we try and recycle it. Stuck in the corner a little bit, and it's a goal kick. It's a goal kick to Coventry. Didn't quite pay off there, didn't quite pay off. 60 minutes played, guys. The hour. Uh, Coventry have a sub now. Uh, Brooke Norton Cuffey off, and Josh Eccles comes on for Coventry. It's a double sub. It's a double sub, just looking at the screen now. 
uh, Jake Bidwell comes off and Josh Wilson Espand comes on. Um, so yeah, double sub for commentary. Oh, it's a triple sub for commentary. It's a triple sub for commentary. Casey Palmer off, Matt Godden on. Casey Palmer off, Matt Godden on. So it's a triple I'm sub. They are definitely going for it. They're 1-0 down in a local derby. They need to go for it. You know, so it's a triple sub for Coventry. Yeah. D and for us, the only sub we've had is DK off, Thomas Asante on. So yeah, 61 minutes played, guys. Just under half an hour to go. Still, Albion 1, Coventry 0. Come on, baggy. Right. 64 minutes played, guys. Coventry get a very dangerous free kick. Uh, not sure which one of our guys got booked, but um, it's a yellow card to an Albion team. Uh, yellow card to an Albion player, sorry. Uh, come on, still 1-0 up, still 1-0 up. We have to defend this, come on. Come on, we have to defend this. We have to defend this. Uh, it looked a bit contentious, guys. It looked like he was going down well before the contact, but, you know, the ref says free kick, so it's a free kick and a booking to the Albion player come on come on save save it save it save it save it button saves button saves button saves yes well done David well done button wow decent parry there uh, commentary took the throw quickly but yeah bit of a breather for the Albion there thanks to David button Oh my days, I know Alex Palmer's injured, but when called upon there, David Button, you know, create the save. Thankfully for the Albion. 65 minutes played, guys. Still, Albion one, Coventry nil. Come on, baby. Second sub for the Albion. I do one. Akai Yakuslu off. Nathaniel Chalaba comes on. Our second deadline day signing from Fulham. Nathaniel Chalaba. Come on, guys. Hey! Chalaba's on. Right, Yakuslu off. Chalaba on. Let's go. That's very good. 66 minutes play, guys. Albion 1, Coventry 0. That's both our new signings on the pitch now, all Brighton and Chalaba. Come on, baggies. 68 minutes played, guys. We get a corner. Come on. Come on, let's make this 2-0 now. Let's make it 2-0. Let's make the game safe. Come on. It's over. Oh. Coventry headed it out, but we managed to recycle it. Floated back into the corner. Coventry headed it out for an Albion throw. It's taken quickly, not even waiting for the towel that time. Uh, so yeah, nothing came of that corner in the end. Uh, 70 minutes played, 20 to go, plus stoppage. Still, Albion 1, Coventry 0, but we need that two-goal cushion. We do need that two-goal cushion because in this second half, Coventry have started to come back into the game. Albion 1, Coventry 0. Come on, baggies. 73 minutes played, guys. Mark Albrighton comes off. John Swift comes on. What a debut game. Yeah, all the crosses he's put in. You know, we probably could and should be 2-0, 3-0 up. Possibly As it is, 1-0. Yeah. Mark Albrighton's done well. John Swift coming on. John Swift is coming on for Mark Albrighton. What a match Albrighton's had. Well done. But we get a corner now. Yeah. We get a corner now. Uh, 73 minutes played. Come on, Albion. Come on. Come on. That, that's going to be on YouTube. Yeah. Are you doing a vlog? <laughs> oh, I, I, get, I get new fans every day. I do with these vlogs. <laughs> right, 74 minutes played, guys. Come on, make this 2-0. Make this 2-0. Floated in. Floated in. Oh! Just over. Just over. Unlucky there. I think it was Brandon Thomas Asante. Yes, yeah, it was Thomas Asante with the touch. Unlucky there. Um, but yeah. So, oh, it did, it did. So, Mark Albrighton off, John Swift on. 1 0 to the Albion, 15 minutes to go, guys. Come on.
76 minutes played, guys. We get away with one. Coventry almost equalised. Complete mess at the back. Complete mess at the back from the Albion. Luckily, the Coventry striker, you know, took the shot and it was over. Luckily, took the shot and it was over. It's an Albion goal kick now. But what were our guys doing at the back there? Oh my God. I, I, think, uh, I think the Coventry player had his name in lights before he'd even hit the ball because that went way over. And yeah, they make another, another sub now, Coventry do. Jamie Allen off, Sean Maguire comes on. Sean Maguire comes on, Jamie Allen off. But what a let off for the album there. It was so close to being 1-1 one, one, and it would have been all our own doing. Doing so well. And then you know, we need, to, we need to stay alert for the next 12, 13 minutes. Come on, Albion. Thankfully for us, unfortunately for Coventry, it is still Albion 1, Coventry 0, but that was so close. That's the closest Coventry have come. That was the closest Coventry have come to equalising. It's got to be said. And it was all our own doing it. You know, complete mess up at the back. And Coventry let us get away with one. Albion being Albion. 1-0 Albion. Albion, thankfully still. 78 minutes played, guys. Come on, Albion. 84 and a half played, guys. It's getting a little bit scrappy now. A few, um, few yellow cards uh, to both Albion and to Coventry. You know, it is getting a little bit scrappy. Coventry again, a little desperate now to get the ball to come up to the Smevic end and get an e equaliser. An equaliser, sorry. <coughs> like, come on. Come on, 85 played. Five to go. We're still 1-0 up. The ball is down the Smevic end, which is where we want it. Uh, the ball is down the Brummie Road end, which is where we want it, sorry. Uh, but... Come on, Albion. Come on, let's keep this now. Let's keep this. It has gotten very scrappy, as it usually does in a local derby. It is very scrappy now. Less than five to go, plus stoppage. We're right behind the boys, as you can hear. Albion won, Coventry nil. Coventry getting desperate. Yeah, Coventry getting desperate now. Come on, Baggies. 86 and a half play, guys. Corner to the Albion, down the Brummy Road end. Come on, if we score now, game over. Come on, guys, come on. Short corner, short corner. Come on, needs to go in. Oh, that's well wide. Well wide, and it's a Coventry goal kick. 87 minutes play, guys. Still, Albion 1, Coventry 0. Getting very nervy, getting very tense. The game I'm getting, I'm getting is getting very, very scrappy, and very getting scrappy. Getting and Davin's getting tired. 1-0 Albion, come on. Five, five minutes added on. I don't know where the refs got that from. Um, Coventry have a free kick, but it's, yeah, it's a Coventry throw. It's a Coventry throw. I have no clue where he got five minutes from added on from this half. Not a clue. There's, hey, that's, that's ours. That's our throw. But yeah, I mean, I don't know where he's got five minutes from. There didn't seem to be a lot of stoppages no, bar from no. the subs. But, you know, five minutes added on. It, yeah, it, has, it, has he been... I, I don't... Yeah, I'm speechless. Well, I don't know where he's got that from. Back on! No! Yeah, well... Don't you dare. Don't you dare. He's using the towel. Oh, Yellow card for using the towel. Yellow card for using oh, the I'm towel, sorry, The towel's gone. The towel's gone. What? He's, he's, tra he's trying the ball so it doesn't slip. Simple as that. Oh well. Donnell Furlong gets booked for using the towel. Oh well. Come on. We're on the way. Sorry, sorry guys. I might have just cut, cut crazy off YouTube because I just swore. It's all right. Everyone swears. No, but, uh, but you know, that's why I don't put the family friendly tag on. But yeah, five minutes added on, guys. Still 1-0 to the Albion. Yeah. 
Commentary, commentary, get us. Commentary, have a sub now. Commentary, have a sub. Callum Doyle off. Liam Kelly on for the last whatever is left of injury time. But yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know where the ref. I don't know where the ref got five minutes from. I don't know. I don't know where the ref got the five minutes from. I don't know why. You know, he's booked Donnell Furlong obviously for time wasting, but he didn't take. He didn't take as long. He didn't take as long then. But yeah, still 1 0 Albion. Come on, back. Corner to the Albion. Even if we don't score down here, even if we don't score now and make it 2 0, it's down by the Bummy Road where Albion need the ball. Come on. If it's down the Bummy Road, Coventry can't equalise. Come on, guys. We might end up playing. We might play Keepy in the corner. We, yeah, we're definitely playing Keepy in the corner. Come on, guys. Oh, we're getting it back. Is it? Oh, yeah, back in the corner. Come on, come on. And it's a Coventry throw. Oh, no. <clears throat> back in the corner, Coventry throw, but there can't be much more left. There can't be much more left. Albion 1, Coventry 0. There can't be much more time left. Chance of you're not fit to referee from the Hawthorns crowd. He's just given a free kick. He's just given a free kick. He's just given a free kick. Oh, no, if they score now, this, this is terrible. This is terrible. Come on. It's out. It's ours. It's a corner. It's a corner. This way. What Coventry It's a corner. You know what? Come on. Come on. Come on, if they score this, it is they like Button! Yes, Button! Button catches! Button catches! He has he has to blow the whistle! No! He has to blow for full time now! Button! Yes! Button saved us the three points! Button saved us the three points! He might not! He might not be first choice keeper! But when we needed him! Yes! He called it! He was called upon when needed! Oh my days! Well done, Button! Well done! He's just given us the three points there! Wow! Wow! That's a win, guys! That's a win! Oh man, what a claim from Button at the end there! Couple of dodgy decisions by the ref near the end there. Thankfully, thankfully we see it out. West Bromwich Albion, West Bromwich Albion won. Coventry City now. Let's go. Yes. A few doubters, you know, but Button did well there to ensure that the three points stay here at the Hawthorns. Oh, Dean Garner scored the difference in the first half. One nil, guys. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Wow. One nil to the Albion, guys. Derby win. Yeah. Yeah. The outfield players, all the Albion players, giving Button a hug. Oh my days. Thank you so much for watching guys. It's a Derby Day win. West Brom won. Commentary now. We did it. That's the first Derby down. One more to go next weekend. Down the road at St Andrews. When we take on Birmingham City. One Derby down. One to go. Come on guys. If you like this video, then please leave a like, subscribe to Crazy Shadow Talks Football if you haven't already done so. Don't forget to hit that bell icon to join my Shadow Squad and get notified on all new content on the channel. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one. Boy boy, Derby Day win. Let's go. Guys. Come on, Albion! Guys. Oh, what a win that was. What a win.
Just, just as Connor shouts down my ear. Wow, what a win. 1-0, I'm here with Liam. I'm here with Liam. Man, we ground that out, didn't we? We Great, absolutely very did. Very good win. Um, Coventry made us work hard. Yeah, absolutely, especially in the second half. I think we were the better team in the mm. first, I them in the second, it, you yeah. know. I think we deserved it, but like, very hard fought win. Yeah, side. yeah, absolutely. I mean, wow, what, what a win. We needed that. One derby down, one to go. Yeah. Blues next week at St Andrews. And yeah, wow, you know, just wow, you know, took our chances. All Brighton, what a player. Played really I, well. I've got to say, All Brighton, yeah. Quite like Chalibur as well, the look of him. Uh, Asante played well when he came on. Just very, yeah. very optimistic at the minute with Albion. Yeah, absolutely, man. Absolutely. Come on, Albion.